Welcome to the Transitions Daily Podcast. Transitions Daily is an online recovery group that offers a daily distribution of popular recovery resources accompanied by a secret Facebook group for discussion. We hope you enjoy today's readings. This is Transitions Daily for December the 2nd, read by Kirsty S. from the East Midlands in the United Kingdom. AA Thoughts for the Day Grandiosity In my teens, I had to be an athlete because I was not an athlete. I had to be a musician because I could not carry a tune. I had to be first in everything because in my perverse heart I felt myself the least of God's creatures. I could not accept my deep sense of inferiority, so I strove to become captain of the baseball team and I did learn to play the fiddle. Lead I must or else. This was the all or nothing kind of demand that later did me in. Bill W. AA Comes of Age, page 53. Thought to Consider We claim spiritual progress rather than spiritual perfection. Acronyms Nuts Not Using the Steps Just for Today, December 1944 AA History The New York World Telegram reported on the dinner held in honour of the 10th anniversary of Bill W's sobriety, December 11th, 1934. That newspaper erroneously called it the 10th anniversary of the founding of AA. There were 1,500 members in attendance that night at the Commodore Hotel. The New York Herald Tribune recounted that Bill's report of AA's 10-year history was impressive. AA went from 15 alcoholics released from the drinking habit in the first year to 40 conversions after three years. At the end of four years, there were 100 members and the book Alcoholics Anonymous had been written. After nearly 10 years, there were more than 12,000 members in 370 groups throughout the United States and Canada and a new unit functioning successfully in Hawaii. Hawaii would not become a state for another 15 years in August of 1959. Daily Reflections Serenity Having had a spiritual awakening as the result of these steps. 12 Steps and 12 Traditions, page 106 As I continued to go to meetings and work the steps, something began to happen to me. I felt confused because I wasn't sure what it was that I was feeling and then I realised I was experiencing serenity. It was a good feeling, but where had it come from? Then I realised it had come as a result of these steps. The programme may not always be easy to practise, but I had to acknowledge that my serenity had come to me after working the steps. As I work the steps in everything I do, practising these principles in all my affairs, now I find that I am awake to God to others and to myself. The spiritual awakening I have enjoyed as a result of working the steps is the awareness that I am no longer alone. As Bill sees it, random quote, freedom through acceptance. We admitted we couldn't lick alcohol with our own remaining resources and so we accepted the further fact that dependence upon a higher power, if only our AA group, could do this hitherto impossible job. The moment we were able to accept these facts fully, our release from the alcohol compulsion had begun. For most of us, this pair of acceptances had required a lot of exertion to achieve. Our whole treasured philosophy of self-sufficiency had to be cast aside. This had not been done with sheer willpower. It came instead as the result of developing the willingness to accept these new facts of living. We neither ran nor fought, but except we did and then we began to be free. Grapevine, March 1962 Big Book Quote Although financial recovery is on the way for many of us, we found we could not place money first. For us, material well-being always followed spiritual progress. It never preceded. Alcoholics Anonymous, 4th edition, The Family Afterward, page 127 If there be divorce or separation... There should be no undue haste for the couple to get together. The man should be sure of his recovery. The wife should fully understand his new way of life. If their old relationship is to be resumed, 
it must be on a better basis, since the former did not work. This means a new attitude and spirit all round. Sometimes it is the best interests of all concerned that a couple remain apart. Obviously, no rule can be laid down. Let the alcoholic continue his programme day by day. When the time for living together has come, it will be apparent to both parties. Alcoholics Anonymous, 4th edition, Working with Others, page 99. 24 hours a day, AA thought for the day. The thoughts that come before having a slip seem to be partly subconscious, and yet it is likely that at least part of these thoughts get into our consciousness. An idle thought connected with drinking casualty pops into our mind. That is the crucial moment. Will I harbour that thought even for one minute, or will I banish it from my mind at once? If I let it stay, it may develop into a daydream. I may begin to see a cool glass of beer or a Manhattan cocktail in my mind's eye. If I allow the daydream to stay in my mind, it may lead to a decision, however unconscious, to take a drink. Then I am headed for a slip. Do I let myself daydream? Meditation for the day. Many of us have a sort of vision of the kind of person God wants us to be. We must be true to that vision, whatever it is and we must try to live up to it by living the way we believe we should live. We can all believe that God has a vision of what he wants us to be like. In all people, there is a good person whom God sees in us, the person we could be and that God would like us to be. But many a person fails to fulfil that promise, and God's disappointments must be many. Prayer for the day. I pray that I may strive to be the kind of person that God would have me be, I pray that I may try to fulfil God's vision of what I could be. Hazelden Foundation, P.O. Box 176, Centre City, MN 55012. My name is Kirsty, and I'm an alcoholic. We hope you enjoy today's readings. You can also receive Transitions Daily via email and discuss today's readings in our secret Facebook group. So for more information, go to dailyaaemails.com today. Other than the 24 hours a day reading, unless otherwise specified, all quotes copyright Alcoholics Anonymous World Services, Inc., 1952, 1957, 1967, 1973, 1975, 1976, 1980, 1981, 1984, 1985, 1988, 1990, or 2001.